Welcome to my channel, we are new here. Hello, you are spiritually connected with the Tiba. That's for sure. Okay, look, you are the blessing that your bloodline has been waiting on. You are. You are the change that your bloodline has been waiting on. I mean, it may suck to hear, but this is the reason why you have had so many challenges. This is the reason why things have been tough, things have been rough, whether that's physically, mentally, emotionally, spiritually, financially, because you are the change. And the only way that you can change things is if you go through that tough stuff and you say, enough is enough. I don't want it no more. I don't want to do it no more. You don't want to hurt no more. You are the change that your bloodline has been waiting on. You the one who got to go through the tough stuff. You the one who is going to make the change because you want to say enough is enough and you're breaking cycles. You're breaking curses because enough is enough. You've had it. You've had enough with certain things. You've had enough. You don't want to live your life like the cycles that you have seen in your bloodline. You don't want that. You want different for yourself. You want different for your future bloodline. You are the change that everyone has been waiting on. Starting with your mindset. It's your mindset. Your mindset is so beautiful. It's so beautiful. Because despite everything that you have been through, you didn't let that break you. You didn't even make it, let it make you. Yes, it hurt it. Yes, you had to sit with it. Yes, you had to deal with it. Yes, you had to go through it. But you, you have grown through it. And every challenge that comes your way, you continuously grow through it. You are the change that your bloodline has been waiting on. There's nobody like you. There hasn't been nobody like you in a while. In a while, to the point where they haven't seen it. People haven't seen it within your bloodline. So they don't know how to be that person. The downside in that is they're judging you. They don't like the moves that you're making because it's uncomfortable. It's uncomfortable to see that change when everyone is deep within the cycles. Everyone is deep within what they're doing. Everyone is deep within who they are and everything that they've seen when they was growing up. Everything that they taught you, you are doing the opposite. The odds were against you. Yes, you conquered. Yet you conquered anyways. And you continuously conquer. You continuously conquer. Like I said, I didn't say that it was easy. But you making a major change. And you making a change for like people in your bloodline that you're not going to even know. <laughs> like, people in your bloodline that's going to be here reaping the benefits of your actions and your mindset when you perish this earth. You are the change that your bloodline has been waiting on. Patiently, they didn't even know that they needed it. And yet, still, they don't know that they need it. Because, like I said, it's very uncomfortable. The way that you move is very uncomfortable. The type of things that you do is very uncomfortable. You breaking those cycles is very uncomfortable. You saying no is very uncomfortable. You not doing things in the ways in which you were taught anymore is very uncomfortable. But this is the change that your bloodline has been waiting on. You were chosen for the task. You are the chosen one. So you want to be different. You want to be judged. You want to be misunderstood. You are. But like under what circumstances does growth happen? Uncomfortable, cir uncomfortable circumstances. Like, but the average person, they don't know this. Or they do know this, but it's so uncomfortable that they rather not change. You saying forget all of that. I want to change. You want to enjoy this lifetime. So you recognize that if you have to make the sacrifices today to have a better tomorrow, then that's just what you want to do. That if you're not going to, if you decide that you don't want to go because your mental health is a, a better priority or the, the environment may make you feel some type of way or bring you down or hold 
holds you back, or you have something better to do that's going to make you happy, then that's what you do. You are the change that your bloodline has been waiting on because you are being you. You're not being who the world says, says that you should be. You are stepping into you. You are stepping into your God, your goddess self. And that requires so much from you. That requires you to step into your higher self. And that means that you have to leave a lot of low vibrational things behind. One at a time. One at a time. I'm not saying you don't do no low, low vibrational stuff. Because we all do. <laughs> we all do. And we may enjoy it as well. And we may not want to change. And that's okay. But there are certain things that you were chosen to reverse. There are certain things that you were chosen for the task. And it's going to require a whole lot of uncomfortability. <laughs> it's going to require you to become very uncomfortable. It's going to require you to go through some things. It's going to require you to lose yourself so that you can find yourself. Because a lot of people don't know who they are. You are the change that your bloodline needs to see. Now when those little babies see you, now when the younger ones see you, now when those who aren't your bloodline see you, they can take something from that. They can learn something from that. Now that when those who have been through what you have been through see you thriving, although you've been through that, it gives them hope. It shows them that they too can do it. It shows them that they don't have to be the same. It shows them that they don't have to continue the same. Only unless they want to. It shows them that they have a choice. It shows them that they have a voice. You are the change that your bloodline has been waiting on. You are. <laughs> Wow, like how many people can say that about themselves? Not many. Not many at all. You are different. You are unique. You are the change that the world needs to see. Because guess what? The world is becoming a better place because of you. Your little baby actions, your little baby steps that you have taken to make yourself a better person is changing the world one step at a time. You are the change that your bloodline needs to see. You're doing your thing, okay? I don't care what people are saying. I don't care who's judging you. I don't care who don't understand you. It's not for them to understand. Your mission, your calling is not a group meeting. It's not. It's not for everyone to understand. Matter of fact, most people won't understand it. Because they have a different purpose here on this earth. Some people are here to make the world a worse off place than what it is. It is what it is. They live in their karma. They live in the life that was chosen for them or that they chose or however it worked. <laughs> like, whatever. And you live in the life that was chosen for you. And it's much deeper than the average person can even imagine. This, and it's much deeper than your bloodline. If I had to be honest. But your bloodline is going to be the first to be affected because you are a part of your bloodline. And they ain't seen nobody like you. They ain't had nobody like you in a long while. There's no generation that they can count that people can talk about who was like you. You are the change that your bloodline has been desperately needing and desperately waiting on. You are like no other. You are one of a kind. So if this video resonates, if it is different, let me know how so. If you are not a member on this channel, I invite you to become a member on this channel. Stand out in the comment section like the God and Goddess that you are. If you don't got Chime already, the mobile banking app, go ahead, click that link in my bio, um, not my bio, in the description, and grab your free $100 for signing up. 
that's all I have for this video. Did I say if you new here? I invite you to hit the subscribe button. I don't know. I don't think so. But look, if you're new here, welcome. I invite you to hit the subscribe button. That is all I have for this video. Stay spiritually you. Stay spiritually in tune. And I'll see y'all over the next video.